Kiki, I think uh, – how, how close were you on that rebound on that last missed free throw, the one that put him back on the line? I was very close. I just couldn't hold on to it. For either of you guys, what, what went wrong in that third quarter when they put together a really nice run and got back into it? Oh, um, a mental lapse. Is that the sort of thing that you guys have been dealing with all year, and how do you move past that? Uh, yeah, um, we try to just – we tried a lot of different things in the locker room, but uh, we just got to overcome it, and hopefully uh, we'll get it by NCAA or even SEC. Ty, you were having a ton of success driving to the rim early in the game. What did Mississippi State do to adjust to that? And what were the difference in the looks you were getting from the first two quarters to the last two? Um, honestly, I don't know. Uh, I feel like I still was getting to the basket. Uh, I think it was just the third quarter that really got us, and then uh, that dug a hole into it. And then obviously we came back towards the end, but it wasn't enough. What did y'all do so effectively to limit McCowan's touches in the first half? It seemed like she really – they didn't even want to pass the ball into her. Um, I think we did a pretty good job of just trying to face guard her and then having another person there so she couldn't drop step when she catched the ball. And so we had to kick – they had to uh, – she had to kick it out and then just have the other people try to score. And obviously this is the second time y'all played him. You might see him a third time next week. How much confidence you have, especially because the last three years in the tournament, if you meet him again, you should be able to come out on top. Um, we have all the confidence confidence in the world. I mean you can't you can't you can't just stay down on this. Uh we got we got a new day, we got two days off and um we just gotta prepare. Um we can't count anybody out, so we just gotta keep going and keep doing what we do. For either of you, uh, I know that it's tough to lose like this, but you get to stay close to home for the SEC tournament. Does this almost add more fuel to the fire before you start postseason play, knowing that you go in a little hungry because this one was that close? Most definitely. Um, it's a motivation, and it's great to be home, close to home. Uh, our fan base will travel, so that'll be fun too. So it just, it's just like a home game. Mikio, how? What did McCowan do differently when she picked up those two fouls and came back and managed to play the rest of the game and still was really impacted? Say that again. Repeat that question. Yeah. What did McCowan do so well after she came back in with two fouls and, and still impacted the game the way she did? I mean, she was just able to go to her go-to, her drop step, easy layup. We just had to do a better job of boxing her out. Yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you. Uh,